Welcome back to Primetime News. Special welcome to folks on OneSpotMedia.com. Up first, the primary exit profile PEP results are out, and the Education Ministry is reporting that exam results for this year are significantly better than they were when PEP was rolled out in 2018. 86 percent of the students who sat the exams have been placed in their high school of choice. As the nation observes the National Day of Mourning for Murdered Children, it was hard to tell that it was exam results day at primary and prep schools island-wide. Still, some people could not hide their excitement. So I feel really good. So I have to go, I have to treat her to something nice. Whatever she asks, I think I will try my best to give it to her because she did her work. And I really, really, really feel happy. And which school is pass her? Six. Education Minister Favol Williams had announced that parents would start receiving exam results by 2 o'clock today. However, when we checked around 4 o'clock Friday afternoon, many schools said they did not receive their results, while some parents reported that the web portal they used to view the results crashed minutes after 2. When we contacted the ministry, we were told they have not received any reports of technical issues with the portal, and it may simply be overwhelmed due to the number of people logging in at once. As for the overall results, the education minister gave the breakdown at a press conference today. 30,984 students were placed according to their choice. That's 85.8%. 39,105 students sat the exams, and the scale for ranking students in each subject ranges from highly proficient and proficient, the highest, to beginning and developing the lowest. In mathematics, 57% of students were highly proficient and proficient. In language arts, 60% ranked in top tiers. Social studies, 67% of students scored highly proficient and proficient. And for science, 64% of students got a good grade. And again, Mrs. Williams said girls continue to outperform boys in maths and language. And the, the pattern is what we have observed over the years um, in terms of girls outperforming boys in mathematics. So that tells us that is something we have to redouble our efforts in to bring our boys up while we continue to support our girls. On a positive note, though, we were told since PEP started in 2019, the overall performance has improved in all areas, with mathematics being the most significant. In the proficient and highly proficient category, 41% of the students were there. If we look at that in 2023, 57% of our students are in proficient or highly proficient 